Testing, 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 test, 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 test. What? <laughs> <coughs> This is scary. My name is Alexander Mitchell, awesome give you a Yes, I am legally named awesome in, for a middle name. I'm just gonna flip this around so I'll look at myself. Cause I'm so goddamn handsome. Oh god. I have sort of a stage fright thing going on right now. Yeah, it's really starting to take its toll on my stress levels. I live in Gothenburg in Sweden. I come from a place called Dalarna, which is basically Skyrim. Level 100 fucking dumbass. First off the bat, um, the reason why I'm doing this in English is because I'm doing this to give back to the community that is YouTube. It's not that I'm trying to be famous abroad, it's more like I enjoy watching a lot of blogs from people all around the world and it would be kind of hard for me or anyone else to understand for that matter if, I, if everybody spoke in their native tongue. And if they did, I think YouTube would not be what it, what it is today. Yeah. Anyway. So that's who I am and why I'm doing this. The second reason why I'm doing this is because I want to keep a log, well, obviously a video log, um, because I, I'm leaving Sweden now, leaving it behind me to go to Germany, Stuttgart, which is kind of a big deal for me because um, I haven't left the borders of Sweden since I was eight, and even then it was just for a holiday or something. I don't really remember that. that well, holiday, my, my family... Alright, we could go into that later. Um, so yeah, why did I come to YouTube? Oh, well, um, <laughs> you can't see this, but I actually have this tutorial right next to me right now, which are five questions that, that you need to answer in your first blog, blog uh, just to make it easier. And I need all the help I can fucking get. <laughs> why did I come to YouTube? I made um, this channel about four years ago when I was living in Vesteros and YouTube has become pretty much a large deal uh, well, a large part of my life in the sense that I use it every day I do um, I, I use it for you know information, documentaries, to laugh, humor, you know, all this stuff music sometimes, you know, it, it's a great tool to find new music it's a hard question, you know, because it's not like build it and they will come all right, next question. What do you hope to get out of YouTube? What? Concerning this, sharing experience. Because I, it's all about giving, it's sort of a thing, I know it's gonna sound corny as fuck, but I wanna give back to the community. What are my passions in life? <laughs> That's question number four. Parkour. I started doing parkour about a year ago and it's become the spark of my life. A year and a half ago when I, uh, I was, um, well I still had a girlfriend, <laughs> uh, we got this gym card, you know the, what couples do, they're like hey let's lose some weight, yeah stop smoking, yeah we can drink less as well, okay if you cook the right food and I get the right, yeah you know, you get it. So we got gym cards and didn't go to the gym that much, as it usually is. But then, towards the end of our relationship, I, I think, I started going to the gym more because I, I found out that it's a great way to, for, for meditation, I guess. I finally found an outlet where, as when I was in the gym, I didn't have to care and nothing could touch me it's like I was in this little bubble of my own little world and even if I remembered 
some of the hard shit that I was going through, it didn't really affect me. Right from the get-go, I knew that I didn't want to get like big and burly, big burly man. But I wanted to get more agile and fast. And we can make it better, faster, stronger. Was it two million dollar man? So I started working out, uh, like becoming more agile and conditioning my body for capoeira. But I wasn't really into capoeira. You know the agile thing. I could get that, but still, it's it's a group thing. I have to, I had to evolve in a group. Parkour was actually just in the in the peripheral vision of my mindset. You know, um, it's something that you see in videos. Like, all right, yeah, I'm gonna do that. New, no. but one night I I googled parkour Gothenburg, and there was this Facebook group. It was called Gothenburg Parkour Academy. And they were gonna have a class that night, and it was free. It was too much of a coincidence to let go. So I started doing parkour. And right the first time when I did it, I was. I must have looked like a fucking ele elephant on stilts. But I loved it. I, right, right from the start, I knew that this is what I wanted to do it's learning how to fly. And I've been doing it ever since, uh, every day. Alright, so that takes care of that, that's my passion in life. Who do you want to meet through YouTube? Ego Raptor. <laughs> I guess I want to meet people that are nothing like me. Why would I... Life, uh, life begins at the edge of your comfort zone. Which is true. I am not making any sense in this video. So that takes you know, care of the five questions. I guess I could add something that's not on the list, the tutorial, and that is the handy tip of the day, which is... This. This is a racer for all you people who can't see, and why would you even be on YouTube if you don't have any eyesight anyways? This is a racer, and it's starting to get dull. Now these cost like a fuckload of money, but there's a trick. There we go. Right. This is jeans. <laughs> this is a pair of jeans. Take your jeans. Jeans, right? Black. Color doesn't matter, I think. And then you take your racer, and you start going like this. Do it about 10 times, and after that, it will be good to go again. I've had this, this one, I've had this for like one and a half months, and it's still good. Now, bear in mind <laughs> that I do not have that much of facial hair, because I'm not that much of a man, but if this had been uh, working for me, like uh, a month and a half, I would give it, I don't know, you do the math. I ain't no professor. Right, that's my handy tip of the day anyways. Um, and this gets easier, I think. <laughs> anyway, that's all for me. My name is Alexander Bilal Awesome Gideon Mugen. And I'll see you soon. Oh, and if you got any tips and tricks uh, that could improve my videos, I would love to hear them. Yes, put them in the comment section below. Oh, god damn it, that's not like such a douche. I will take them to heart. Unless it's stop being ugly or stop being such a dumbass. Stop, stop being such a tool. The list goes on. Um, yeah. Let me know what you think. Peace and love through understanding. This is, uh, jeans pants? What, what the fuck? Yeah. Jeans. The fabric is jeans. Don't know the... Oh god. I can't even talk. You put it, you do a reverse, what the fuck would you even call that?